The stripping tool for Raychem's self-regulating cable is a cable stripping tool with no exposed or moving blades. The tool has two sets of blades designed for precise scoring of the outer and inner jackets of the cables. The yellow dot indicates the blade for the outer jacket. The word outer is also written on the tool. The red dot indicates the blade for the inner jacket. The word inner is also written on the tool. The tool also includes a unique core scoring feature that prevents damage to the conductors. The tool also has ruler marks on it for measuring lengths during installation. The tool has a robust metallic body, ergonomic contour, and replaceable blades. The scoring blades are protected by a spring-loaded cap that rotates automatically. For safety, the cap rotates back to its original position automatically after the cutting operation is performed. The tool is designed for use of Raycam BTV-CR, BTV-CT, QTV-RCT, XTV-CT, KTV-CT, HWAT, XL Trace, I stop and Raysol self-regulating heat tracing cables. To strip the outer jacket, step one, use the blade mark outer with the yellow dot to score around the outer jacket of the heating cable. Step 2. Bend the heating cable at the score to separate the jacket. Insert the jacket slitting tip under the cable jacket. Pull the stripping tool towards the end of the heating cable to slit the jacket. To strip the inner jacket, complete the braid preparation steps in the appropriate connection kit installation's instructions. Use the blade mark inner with the red dot to score around the inner jacket of the heating cable. Bend the heating cable at the score to separate the jacket. Insert the jacket slitting tip under the cable jacket. Pull the stripping tool towards the end of the heating cable to slit the jacket. To strip the core, carefully notch the end of the cable with the diagonal cutter without cutting the bus wires. Beginning at the end of the inner jacket and following the directional arrow, score along both edges of the core with the core stripping end of the tool. Pull out bus wires with needle nose pliers.
Use the diagonal cutter to cut away the core and remove any remaining polymer at the end of the bus wires.